is Elizabeth. We welcome you back to Capital Gymnasium, Beijing, China, final flight, ladies short program. From Russia, Elizaveta Tukhtamusheva, at 19, she's almost a veteran, broke onto the senior circuit 2011, winning her first two senior Grand Prix. She was the talk of the town, heading into the Sochi Olympics, but fell off pace, did not make the Olympic team, John, you talked about her triple axle in the warm-up, and that took her to the world title in 2015. Her 2014-2015 season was just, it was one for the ages, winning Europeans, winning the world title, landing that triple axle along the way. And when you have a triple axle, a triple-triple combination, shouldn't be too hard for you, and she has plenty of height for it, but a little late getting out on the landing there. up and down type of career continued last year where she came eighth at Russian Nationals, didn't make it to Worlds. We've seen her working on her triple axle in practice at these Grand Prix, but not including it. Here comes a triple Lutz. Much better result than the landing of that triple-triple combination. You know, Tracy, I watch her skate and am reminded of the embarrassment of riches that the Russian Federation has in this ladies' event. It's wild to me to think that someone that was a world champion just a couple of years ago, you could say is the third, maybe fourth best Russian lady right now. The double axle with the arm over the head. I think the one thing, though, that Elizaveta is not able to do that some of her young Russian teammates are is sort of just deliver with a motion. She, she tends to look like she's thinking a bit through the program. Well, if she has the triple axle, that's okay, but without it, she's vulnerable. Only 19 years of age, almost feels like she's a veteran with all she's been through, Elizaveta Tukhtamusheva. She has already competed this year on the Grand Prix. She finished fourth at Skate Canada. Would really need a win here to make her a player going forward. Having finished fourth at her first assignment, you need a win and then you need a little bit of help, help as well <laughs> if you hope to qualify for the final. And, you know, saying that she's 19 years old and a veteran, well, when your Russian counterparts are 16, 17 years old, that's what tends to happen. This first triple toe is really big, and the second triple toe, she got a little bit back in the air, had to do that little double three turn there to avoid going down, but has so much air awareness that she was able to correct that. You can see that tap here, getting her a little off axis towards the camera there, and that's why she had to take that little turn as she got back on her blade instead of towards the front of the blade, which is where you would prefer to land. Flying sit here and then going right into a variation. You know, this was a, a good skate for her, but you could tell when she finished the program that she wasn't blown away with how she skated. And she absolutely, as a, as a former world champion, has high expectations of herself. Taking a look at that triple Lutz again here, much more solid landing there than what we saw in the combination. 
now the scores for Elizaveta Tuktomusheva. High 60s at Skate Canada. These come down a little bit, 64.88. So that's good enough to move her ahead of Ashley Wagner of the United States. She is in second place for now.